All right, so Dave, tell me what we got here. Well, we have a mobile astronomical observatory. It's built into a 20-foot pace trailer. The rear section, the observatory, is approximately 8 by 8, and the front section is 12 by 8. It has uh, a dinette, a uh, built-in kitchen, and a bathroom with a shower. Okay. Um, now you look to me like you've got the telescope all strapped down. Yes, it's in the travel position now. It's bolted to some cross members and it has the straps to steady it. Uh, when you get to your observing location, you would need to unfasten these ratchet straps. Then you can uh, go out opening the dome. This right. is a safety latch. You uh, just unhook it, lay it sideways. It was, I put it on there in the event that one of the latches failed, the air wouldn't pick it up and lift it off the trailer. Okay. Okay. Um, the, the dome is secured through these three latches like this. You unscrew this little knob, flip this up. There's three of these. Okay, now the dome is Unsecured. All right, and then how do you open up the? Okay, you can use these as a handle to rotate the dome manually. Okay. The dome does only operate manually. It does, it's not driven by a motor. Okay. Now, to open the dome, the shutter over here on the side, I have a uh, telescoping pole extended a couple of sections. And I, let's see, go around this side. Screws on this little, there's a little, uh, I don't know what you call it, <laughs> little device there. You screw this on a few turns. Okay? Now, when you push this, well, we're going to unlock the handle first. Okay. Push up the shutter. And it goes back and it's held in place by a couple of arms. Then you can unscrew this. Stow it. This intermediate shutter here, you can fasten this up to block some wind, or if you want to observe down very close to the horizon, you can adjust it with the chain length all the way down to the lower position. Okay. So generally, I, unless I'm trying to see something right on the horizon, I kind of leave it up. It helps block wind from coming in and shaking the scope. 